This is what you saved your lunch money for, your field to the great evolution. The Gator Hunt is underway. Field going to roll to the back straightway on that inside line. He's going to take off of the top spot here. Can he hold it on the opening lap? Carson Garrett at 15. He's got company lurking to the outside. Can he get a run? He does. It'll be Garrett leading on lap number one. Bacon in the Hoffman Auto Racing number 69. Steals away the third spot. Can he pick the pocket of the three P as Jet would say? And we'll try to get him up into the second spot off of turn number four. Advantage still to the Avanti window door number three. They work into turns three and four. Battle for the lead. Starting to brew here. On the inside goes Garrett. He'll fly the front tires a little bit. On the outside, here comes Kyle Cummins. Trails by .075 at the line that time. Garrett's got company, and it's not the one you want. On the outside, Kyle Cummins going to take over the top spot. The 3P up into the race lead. Working top shelf in this one. Brady Bacon searching for lines. Garson Garrett down to the bottom, Bacon to the outside. Garrett trying to hold the position. Bacon going to hold it at the line. CB right there, and now behind him, CJ Leary going to crack the top five for the race lead. Garson Garrett throws the slide of one and two, can't make it stick. Brady Bacon gets shuffled back to third. Now Kyle Cummins under attack again, going to dive in it down to the middle off of turn number four, holds on to it, and the Monty went over door number three, P. It will be Cummins holding on to the top spot. Carson Garrett finding another gear here. Getting right back into the mix after he'd fallen back to third. Brady Bacon now coming back after him. Goes back to the outside. Bacon going to go down to the bottom. On the outside, once again, holding him off. It's going to be the three. Kyle Cummins continues to lead the way. Brady Bacon right there. Trying to get one more, maybe. Crack off his first win of the season. Throws the slide on Bacon through three and four. Nearly takes it up over the cushion. He's got second. Logan Seavey into the runner-up spot. Leader dealing with traffic. Kyle Cummins, working by a pair of slower cars, has one between himself and the 57. Logan Seavey right there now within a couple of car lengths. Does he pull the trigger this time and it turns three and four? Yes, he does. He's going to go to the bottom of the speedway, tries the inside line, Cummins to the outside. He's going to pedal hard around to the front straightway, holds on to it. Sees the nose of the 57. Now going to enter to the middle of turn number one. Doesn't quite take it across the racetrack. In fact, he stays right to the middle, all the way to the back straightway. Going to try to use the slower car as a pick here. Protects the bottom side. 57 going to have to go outside to turns three and four. Has to adjust his tactics here as they work around this time. It will be 11 laps remaining. Next time by 10 to go. And here comes the slide for the lead. Can he hold it? CV across the nose of the three up to the cushion. It'll be Cummins working back to his inside. Here we go once again. Slide into three. Does he have it this time? He has got Cummins cleared by several car links. Bounces are off the cushion. Cummins back to the inside. But you've got a new leader. It's Logan CV. Logan Seavey takes over the top spot, Cummins back to his inside, nothing happened to try to pin him up behind a slower car, couldn't get it done though, as he'll work to the inside of the five machine to put him a lap down now. Comes up on Osborne to put him one lap down, not quite able to get there, bounces are off of the cushion into number four, Cummins going to close right back in on him, battling for position in front of him. High speed chest this time into turns three and four. Where do they go? CB going to go to the outside. Cummins right there in his back bumper. He's going to look to the inside a little bit. No, can't get there. CB now he's going to go to the middle. He's going to go three wide in traffic and hold on to it. Two laps remaining, and it's game on at the front of this one. CB has it right now, is able to clear and puts three lap cars between himself and the three. What a move by CB to maybe secure the win here tonight as he'll come around this time to the wave of the white flag. He's got one to go. Able to clear traffic quickly. Ew, look out, red light's going to come on. We got a couple of them upside down over at turns three and four. Getting a look at the replay. Ooh, going in and just getting up into the side of Jaden, trying to get a run. So he was being challenged by Kevin Thomas Jr. Two laps shootout for 10 grand. Here we go. CB going to roll to the middle of the restart. Look to the inside. Here comes Kevin Thomas Jr. The Inferno Armor number three. Going to slide up the racetrack. Tries to take second. Challenge to the inside. Coming with a 3P of Kyle Cummins. Cummins going to retake the spot. KTJ right back there to challenge. White flag coming out while they're racing. Logan CB says thank you very much. He's going to pull away with it. Seven tenths of a second. He'll carry it to the high side of turns one and two. Onto the back straightway for the final time in this one. He'll find turns three and four. 
And to the front straightway, a $10,000 check awaits. Logan saving a 57. Side by side at the line for second, Kyle Cummins. Going to have it over Kevin Thomas Jr., CJ Leary, Carson Garrett, your top five.